Hi and welcome back to my channel. In this video today, I will be sharing 10 digital products you can make in Canva and sell online. These digital products are in no particular order. I just decided to put all of the digital products that I've created on this channel into one video. If you want to see full length tutorials on any of these digital products, I will have all 10 tutorials linked in the description. Along with those tutorials, check the description box for timestamps if you want to skip ahead to a certain part in the video. So let's get started. Head to canva.com. Click on create a design. In the search bar, you can type whatever you're looking for. If you go to the left side panel and click on custom size, you can enter in the dimensions for your product. The first digital product is greeting cards. The second digital product is gift tags. The third digital product is printable planners. The fourth digital product is event signage. The fifth digital product is wall art. The sixth digital product is invitations. The seventh digital product is book covers. If you type in what you want in the search bar and it doesn't bring up the dimensions you need, you can add a custom size. If you go to the left side panel and click custom size, you can enter in the dimensions for your item. For the book cover, I already found out the dimensions of the book cover. But once I put in the width and the height, I click create new design. So this book cover is going to be specifically for Kindle Direct Publishing. You can create book covers for novels as shown here, 
or you can also create book covers for low content books as well. So you go to kdp.amazon.com and you can find a print cover calculator and templates. You enter in your book information as shown here, including the book size and the page count. Once you do that, hit calculate dimensions. And once you do that, KDP gives you the dimensions for your book. If you click on download template, it'll give you an image that you can upload to Canva to use to help you design your cover. And again, check the description box for any related videos that I may have mentioned. And you can also leave a comment if you'd like me to make a video specifically for anything that I've mentioned in the video. The eighth digital product is stickers. The ninth digital product is patterns. The 10th digital product is digital planners. Once you have your digital product, you need to download it so that you can sell it. So in the upper right hand corner, click on share. Click on download, change to whatever file type, and then download. Once you have your digital product downloaded, then you can begin to sell it. There are lots of different places where you can sell digital products online. Creative Market is a marketplace where you can sell digital products such as the ones mentioned in this video. On Creative Market, you can sell fonts, templates and themes, graphics, photos, videos, illustrations, icons, and more. Etsy is another marketplace where you can sell digital products. Etsy is probably the most popular one and the one people talk about the most. Another place where you can sell digital products is Spoonflower. So with Spoonflower, you can upload your design or photo and then sell it on fabric, wall art, curtains, and more. I'm also going to leave a link in the description to Canva's content license agreement so you can see what's allowed when selling digital products. If you want me to make a video on more places where you can sell your digital products, let me know in the comments. 
And this concludes the video on 10 digital products that you can make in Canva and sell online. If you found this video helpful, let me know by hitting the like button. Subscribe for more videos like this and hit the bell to be notified when I upload a new video. Remember to check the description box for full tutorials on all 10 of these digital products, as well as some other important links that may have been mentioned in the video. And as always, thanks for watching.